This video discusses how to analyze data from an experiment performed to find the empirical formula of copper 2 sulfate. The first step in the experiment was finding the mass of an empty evaporating dish, which measured 25.1 grams. Approximately 4 grams of hydrated copper 2 sulfate, a blue crystalline powder, was added to an evaporating dish until the mass measured 29.2 grams. Heating a hydrate causes water in the crystal structure to convert to steam, which dries the salt sample. As copper 2 sulfate is heated, its color changes from a dark blue color to a much lighter color, as the sample dries due to the conversion of water to steam. The resulting material is called an anhydrous salt, or anhydrate, and takes on a powdery appearance. After heating, the combined mass of the anhydrous copper 2 sulfate and dish was 27.7 grams. Let's calculate some masses. The mass of the hydrate was determined to be 4.1 grams by finding the difference between the original sample in the evaporating dish, 29.2 grams, and the mass of the